tell me your name? Monse. Hi, Monse. I'm so glad that you can be on this week's Monday Mindset. I decided to interview Monse because Monse really does have a positive attitude about a lot of things. Monse, do you want to tell us about something that makes you really unique? It makes me unique because, like, if I was, like, Miss T, I would be happy if I couldn't, like, walk. It's okay for people that can't walk because at least they can run around in the, um, spin around in the wheelchair or do stuff on the wheelchair. Do you want to show all the kids how your wheelchair moves? Mm-hmm. So you can go pretty much everywhere in your wheelchair, is that right, Monse? Right there at your fingertips. All right, Monse was telling me that you were born with a special syndrome. Tell me about that, Monse. It's a syndrome that you, when you're born, you don't have knees or a special bone from your hip. Mm. So that's why I cannot walk, but I can still walk with my walker. Mm-hmm. So you use a walker to walk or you use your wheelchair? Mm-hmm. Um, would you tell me about something that's really hard for you? What's a challenge that you have to work on to be independent? Tell me how you do it. First, I raise up my chair, and then I go, I stand up in my chair very carefully, and then I hold this on my hand, and then I just raise my hand and then open the cabinet. You're working really hard to be independent, aren't you? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Sometimes you ask for help, and sometimes you do it by yourself. That's great, Monse. Monse, tell me about your positive attitude. I can move around and I can like stand up and walk and that's how I was born. So instead of thinking about the things that are harder or the things that you can't do, you really focus on what you can do. Mm-hmm. That's a great attitude. Monty, tell me to you, what does it mean to have a growth mindset? My growth mindset is because I can do like the stuff like if someone tells me, oh, can you do this? Or that I can just wheel around and go do it. You don't let anything stop you, do you, Monse? No, and if it's something's hard for you, I know you practice until you can get it. Yep, like going up the stairs and going down. That's right. Tell me, how have you been practicing that? I've been practicing because when I was a baby, I was so scared going up and down because I thought I was going to fall because there were so many stairs. I look so like I think about it and I saw videos and they told me like put one foot up the stairs and then push yourself more higher so you can get the other leg and then that's how you go all the way up. So a challenge for you has been learning to go up and down the (laughs) stairs? That's awesome. And you can do it by yourself? Way to go, Monse. Well, Monse, I just love your positive attitude, and I'm just, you're a great example of a a growth mindset and someone who has grit. So thanks, Monse. Thank you. Monse, another really special, unique thing about you is that you're bilingual. Tell me what two languages you speak. I speak Spanish and English. Tell me what that's like to be bilingual. It's fun because if you only speak English, then you won't know what they're talking about, and then... If you speak Spanish, then you don't know what they're saying in English. So that's why it's more fun for people who speak two languages like me. Like I speak Spanish and English. Like in the morning, I talk to my parents in Spanish. And then in the afternoon, I talk to my sister in English. And that's how we communicate. Monse, that is really awesome that you speak two languages. What a great challenge for your brain to be able to learn and grow in two languages. Say something for us in Spanish. Hola, como esta? Como fue tu día? Thanks, Monse. Bye-bye. Bye.